Hey, it's Ryan. I'm going to show you three quick methods how to find your IP address on your Perl Nexus and pair it to Epifan Edge. Let's dive in. For automatic pairing, you'll need to be using an internet connected network with the DHCP server. Start by formatting a USB stick to extended FAT, FAT32, EXT2, or EXT4. Insert the USB into your computer. And first you'll need to rename the USB Epifan, all capital letters. Then on that USB, you'll create a folder also named Epifan, all capital letters. Next, you'll navigate to your Epifan Cloud account and choose the team you'd like to pair your Perl Nexus to. In this case, we're using Studio. Top right, you'll see Pair Device. Click here and press Get Pairing File. Once this downloads, find the file and you're going to pull it into the Epifan folder. We'll copy it from here. Go to the USB drive named Epifan. Go to the folder and paste. Now, eject the USB and you can insert the USB into the front of the Perl Nexus. A successful pairing is indicated by a steady blue light. A flashing red light indicates pairing has failed. Please recheck the previous steps, our online documentation via our support page on our website, or reach out to your IT team. Your device will appear in Epifan Edge. From there, if you have a premium Edge account, you can click on the admin login to log directly into the Perl Nexus, or simply copy the IP address that you see here in the UI, put it into your web browser as connected to the same network as the Nexus, and you can start configuring. With Perl Nexus turned on and attached to your DHCP network, you can find the IP address by attaching an HDMI display. Just gonna connect my display here. And we can see on the display, we have some information, including the MAC address, the link speed, the IP address, which can be used to enter into your browser, and also a pairing code for quick pairing. If you don't have a DHCP network or require more advanced network security settings, you can access your Perl Nexus via its maintenance IP. Connect your Perl Nexus directly to your computer via an Ethernet cable or to a network switch that both your computer and Perl Nexus are connected to directly. On your computer, navigate to your network connections and you're gonna change your IPv4 settings of your adapter. To do this, click Properties. Navigate to IPv4, Properties, and you'll change the IP address of your computer. The IP address you'll enter is 192.168.255.249, and the subnet mask will be 255.255.255.252. Press OK. Also close this window, and close out this window here too. In your web browser, you'll enter the maintenance IP for your Perl Nexus, which is 192.168.255.250, and press enter. You'll be prompted to log in. The default username is always lowercase admin, A-D-M-I-N, with a blank password. Now you can start configuring. Finally, there's one alternative method, and that's to assign an IP address to your Perl Nexus using DHCP reservation. Every Perl Nexus has a MAC address printed on the device label. Your network admin can use this to assign a DHCP reserved IP address directly to your Perl Nexus. If you have any questions at all, please feel free to reach out to support at epifan.com. For more tips, stay tuned, and we'll see you soon.